channel long time no see i know i haven't been posting in a little bit but that is because i've been super busy lately and i needed some inspiration on a video to do so today i am going to be showing you guys my morning everyday skincare routine I know that most of you guys probably don't have a skincare routine and if you're looking to get into one, I just recommend using a basic skincare routine. Now the ones that I do are pretty long and extensive. You may not be looking to do as many steps as I am, but I love skincare and I love taking care of my skin and figuring out different treatments and things that work best for my skin. So without further ado, let's get into today's video. All right, so now that we're in my bathroom, I'm just going to put on my headband. This way I don't get any product in my hair. I know that this might seem weird to a lot of you guys, but I just use baby soap to wash my face. Honestly, this stuff makes my skin so soft and it really helps with my breakouts. So I've been loving it because it's so gentle on my skin as well. So this is what I use to wash my face every morning. So I just squirt about that much in my hand and then I just rub it all over my face. I like to dry cleanse with it first in order to get the product melted into my skin really good before I use it, before I use any water. And now I just activate it with water. I'm going to use my facial brush. And this is just going to help to exfoliate my skin and really work the product into my skin even better. So now I'm just going to rinse this off my face and then I'll be right back. Alright you guys, so now I am back in my room and now I can take this off because I don't have to worry about getting any of the cleanser in my hair. So my next product that I like to use is this Good Molecules Nice and My Brightening Toner. And I love this toner because it helps to brighten the dark spots that I have around my mouth from Mask Me. I used to get lots of acne whenever I would wear a mask. And now that I'm fully vaccinated, I do not have to anymore as long as whatever store I'm going into does not require them. But yeah, so I'm sorry if the lighting is a little off today. I know I definitely look weird. Here, let's see. All right, so like I said, this is the next step that I like to do. So I just put some of it in my hand, in my hands, and I rub it around, and I kind of just apply it everywhere on my face. But I really like to target those areas that have those dark spots. And then I do kind of like to just push it into the skin. So you guys, if I look a little rough, I worked out for like two hours this morning and my hair has been really messy ever since, but I didn't want to take it out because then, you know how like you get that line in your hair from having your hair up for so long? I don't want that to happen either. But my next step is this Good Molecules Niacinamide Serum. I love this because again, it brightens my skin, but I do have some oily parts on my skin. So this helps to reduce the oiliness. And overall, this helps so much for me to not get any breakouts because I noticed that when I started incorporating more niacinamide into my skincare routine, my skin started clearing up a lot more. I am going on vacation here this weekend. It's only going to be like a little like weekend getaway trip, but I am so excited and I cannot wait. So I probably will do like a get ready with me before vacation type video 
where basically I'm probably just gonna like pluck my eyebrows, do an extensive skincare routine, so like a face mask and stuff, do some extra stuff while I'm in the shower, like a hair mask, shave, all of that stuff. I might do a pack with me too for vacation. So I definitely have some video ideas for the future and I'm looking forward to filming them for you guys. So this next product is this Up and Up 10% Benzoyl Peroxide. I love this because it helps to prevent any future breakouts, but it also helps the breakouts that you already have. It helps the pimples form to a head. So I just use a little bit of that all over my face. And like I said in the beginning of this video, you know, if you guys are a beginner and you're just starting a skincare routine because you think it's going to benefit your skin and stuff, and you don't really have any skincare concerns, then definitely a basic skincare routine is the way to go and you do not need to do as many steps as me. I do have some more treatments that I like to throw in at nighttime as well. So that's why my morning skincare routine is a little bit shorter than my nighttime skincare routine. I'm actually thinking of filming my nighttime skincare routine, so definitely let me know if that's something that you guys want to see in the future. But my next product that I like to use is this CeraVe Moisturizing Cream. I absolutely love this stuff because it moisturizes my skin enough and gives back the moisture to my skin that my skin barrier really needs. For reference, I do have combination skin. My T-zone gets really oily and then the rest of my skin usually is pretty dry. But I think that this moisturizer works pretty well for my skin type. It moisturizes my skin enough to its needs, but not too much to the point where I'm gonna break out. I also love this because it mattifies my skin in the areas that I get really oily, which is a good thing. So for all of these techniques, I am just like rubbing them around first to spread the product around my skin, and then I just pat them and press them into my skin. And then my last step, but the most important step in a skincare routine is sunscreen. I do like to use this Neutrogena Hydro Boost Water Gel Lotion. And I absolutely love this stuff because it helps my skin to not break out because it is such a thinner formula. It's like a lotion. So I don't have to worry about it breaking out my skin, which is amazing, but it still gives me the protection that I need. And it also comes with a nice glow to the skin as well without looking too greasy. And don't forget your neck or your ears. So that is it for my morning skincare routine. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. It's good to be back and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.